Okay. We we'll continue our question. Now, number five says, which of the following is a multiple of three? Now, very simple. Remember I told you, you have a time, so you don't have anything to start wasting. You need to know how to go straight, you know. What you just need to do from here, or just have, and then when they say multiples, multiples mean rolling, rolling the number. So, you remember when you're starting, you have to start from one. So, which is what? Three times one will give us three. Three times two will give us what? Six. Three times three will give us what? Nine. Three times four will give us twelve. Three times five will give us fifteen. Three times six will give us what? Eighteen. You can also say add three to this. When you add three to, to, to eighteen, that will give us what? Twenty-one. When you add three to twenty-one, that will give us what? Twenty-four. You can also say three times nine, you know, twenty-seven. So if you look at the option we have here now, which one is the what? Multiples of what? Of three. That is what? Six. Now, the next one, which of the following is not a multiple of six? Very true. The same thing. You just let's go ahead and do that. So six times one will give us six. Six times two will give us twelve. Six times three will give us what? 18. Six times four will give us what? 24. Six times five will give us 30. If you add six to this, give us 36. So either way you can, if you add six to that, that will give us what? 42. Six times eight will give us what? That is what? 48. Now if you look at from the option we have, which of them is not the multiple of six? That is gonna be what? C. So that is that for these two questions. You need to know how to be able to solve your question, you know, very fast and then accurate to get your answer.